The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 17 Frozen Gifts Rarity video for you guys. And just to let you guys know before we get into this, I do want to point out one thing here. This was not compiled by me. These graphics were not compiled by me. I just put it all together into a video for you guys so it's easily consumed and you guys can find exactly what you're looking for. The actual information actually came from a user named Idle Wild Gaming who does have a YouTube channel and I'm going to leave a link to that in the description below as well as to his Twitter. He also provided the information for the last set and I know you guys really liked that video. It got a ton of uh, likes and a ton of people were asking me to make a new one so I did want to make sure that I did that for you guys as well. So so be sure to thank Idlewild Gaming for taking the time to put all this stuff together. Uh, it's also a good point, by the way, that all of this was compiled by fellow users. So we got something like, I want to say 6,000 or something responses. Uh, yeah, 6,000, I'm sorry, 813 responses. So this is a huge sample size, guys. We know for a fact that these numbers are pretty damn close to the actual numbers as far as like how rare they were in the game. So this should give you guys at least a general idea of how rare each of the gifts are. And we've kind of found throughout the first set of the Ultimate Freeze gifts that the more rare they were, typically the better they were, as you can probably imagine. So the chances are if you've got something that's really rare in here, it's probably something really good. And if you have something that's super common, chances are it's not something particularly amazing. Although you never know. EA might send us a, a curveball here at some point and maybe we'll find something that's very common and ends up being epic, something really rare that ends up being crap. Who knows? But with that said, guys, let's hop into it. The first set of Frozen Gifts that will open up on 1226. So the first set here, guys, we have one at four and a half or 4.05, excuse me, percent of the gift. And that means out of all the gifts that were opened, 4.05% of them were this particular gift. So that's going to tell us that that gift is kind of uncommon. Now, the second one is actually very, very rare. I think it's either the second or the third rarest one of the bunch that we have remaining. And that one is going to open up on 1226 as well. It's 1.38% of the gifts. Very, very, very rare, guys. Um, so definitely, uh, if you have that one, that's something that you should be paying attention to because I think a, a lot of people are going to like what comes out of that. We don't have any idea uh, as far as like specifics on what's going to be in these gifts, and I'm not going to speculate too much, but I have heard a lot of people saying that this could be an out-of-position Sean Taylor linebacker card. And if it is, man, that card is going to be absolutely nasty, and it's going to go for a ton of coins. And the last one that we have, a lot of people are referring to this as like the Starburst gifts because the colors are the orange, the red, and the pink. Very, very similar to Starburst. I don't think it has any reference to any sort of players or anything like that. So I don't think Starburst is anything other than just what people are calling it. But that one's going at about a 5.4% of the gifts ratio. So it's the most common of the bunch, but still uncommon by the entire gift standards. Moving on now to December 27th. And the first one that you see there on your screen, that is the rarest gift that we have among the second set of gifts. So the first one that we had, the first set of gifts, the rarest gift actually ended up being something pretty damn beastly. It was a milestone player, or excuse me, a motivators player. I almost said milestone, a motivators player, which is obviously very, very good. Those go for a ton of coins. So there's a good chance that this is going to be something really, really good. It has a bunch of different gifts. So my, my guess is that it's going to be maybe a variety of different things, but we just don't know exactly what's going to come out of this one. But that one is very, very rare. It should be pretty cool. And it's, you know, like I said, it's it looks pretty cool as well. It's the Santa sleigh with the gifts all over the top of it. Should be pretty a good gift. Second one is also a pretty rare gift. This one almost, almost reaches into the very rare category as well. It's a blue gift, obviously, with the green bow on the top of it. Don't know, have, really don't have any idea what that is. Some people have said that it could be a flashback player for the Jets. I'm not 100% sure on that, but that's a possibility. And then the last one of the day for the 27th is the gold. I, I guess I'm not really sure what people are calling these, like kind of shiny boxes of some sort, but 5.1% of gifts are this one. And unfortunately, we just don't really have any idea as far as like speculating on what this one even is. 
on to December 28th, and this is, we have two kind of pretty common ones, I guess, here on your far left. We have the one that's at 9.66%. That is a very common gift. Um, that one, I think, is probably not going to be anything super amazing. You never know. It, it, my guess is that this one is going to be contracts, just based on the fact that it kind of has that look to it. And not only that, but it's also extremely common. So, you know, we, we do probably imagine this isn't going to be anything super amazing. The second one, actually, if you look closely, does have a Falcons logo on it. This is the uh, the silver gift with the light blue uh, ribbon on it. So that could have something to do with the Falcons, but we really don't have any idea. And then the third one, again, that one, we really don't know. For some reason, this reminds me of, like, the Poland flag. Maybe I'm thinking of the wrong country, but um, red and white, just straight down the middle. Pretty simplistic gift, but it is rare at 3.11%. So this one probably contains something pretty good. On the 29th, again, we've got a rare one there on the far left. That one is just 3.13% of gifts, and that one is by far the rarest of the bunch that day. The other two are both pretty common. They're not really particularly anything amazing, it doesn't look like. Although the second one does have uh, some sort of a reference to a flashback somebody told me. I can't really see it. I don't know what I'm really looking for, though, unfortunately. So some people are saying that that one is a flashback. And then the third one, it looks like is going to be some sort of a stadium, as far as what I've been told. Uh, again, these are all speculations. I don't really have any information on this, but 7.05%, so pretty common on that one as well. Now let's move on to December 30th, which is, of course, my birthday. And we have a huge discrepancy of gifts on this one. The one on the far left there, that rose one, is very, very common. Over 10% of all the gifts that were pulled were this one. So chances are, if you got a handful of gifts, you probably got this one. So that's, uh, you know, that's interesting. And then on the far right, we have one that's on the opposite end of the spectrum. Very, very rare. That gold one with the white bow and a person holding it. That one is very, very rare. Again, we don't really know for sure what the, what these are going to be, but the discrepancy between this between these tells us that the one that's on the far left probably not going to be anything amazing, and the one on the far right probably is going to be something really, really nice. And then obviously we have the one in the middle as well. This one has a flashback symbol in the bow, or no, excuse me, on the ball there on the the bottom left hand corner. If you look closely, you can see a flashback symbol. So that one's kind of a dead giveaway as far as what that's going to be. Probably some sort of a flashback pack or something along those lines um, but I doubt that it's gonna be any sort of like a beast flashback player but you never know it could be it could be but it is an uncommon one at 4.67 percent of gifts now on to New Year's Eve D December 31st this one is kind of an interesting set because we've got the ones on the far left there which are the Santa packages there's like a handful five of the Santa uh, gift bags there now there are some people that are speculating that that's gonna give you five players of some sort, but I, I don't really know for sure on that. I, I really don't know. That seems kind of un unlikely to me, given how common that gift is at 7.78%. I think it's more likely that we're going to get something beastly out of the right one there or the one in the middle. The one in the middle, a lot of people are saying is going to be some sort of a Ghost of Madden player. I don't know. I, I don't see anything that particularly says that to me, but I haven't really super you know, gone in and inspected those, but at 2.69%, chances are you're going to get something good out of that one, and then that light blue box, that one is very rare, uh, I shouldn't say very, but it is quite rare at a 2.11%, so chances are you're going to get something good out of that one as well. Now let's move on to the the final day of the whole promo, and that is, of course, New Year's Day. We are getting two gifts that day. Both of them are common. We've got the one on the far left there, and that one is a 7.31%, the red gift with kind of the green and red bow, some string coming out of it. Again, probably not going to be anything amazing. And then we've got the one on the far right there, which is kind of like a white gift with some pink and red and a gold bow on top of it at 7.03% of the gifts. Now, what I will say about these is despite the fact that they're both common, I think that these ones, there will probably be something pretty good out of at least one of these, given the fact that this is the final day of the promo. EA is kind of notorious for doing that, kind of saving the best for last, or at least close to last. So I, I would say there's a pretty good likelihood that we're going to get at least something good out of one of these. Um, I've heard people saying that the, the last one there could be an elite out of position player, could be a new elite out of position player as well. We really don't know. But anyway, guys, that is the whole video. That, those are all the gifts. I think there are 45 of them now total. So 
kind of interesting. Hopefully you guys learned something. Hopefully you got some good gifts as well. And hopefully you'll be able to continue to pull them here over the next couple of days. Thank you guys for all the support. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do me a favor. Drop a like on it. And make sure you subscribe to the channel. And of course, be sure to head on over to Idlewild Gaming's channel as well. I will leave again a link to that in the description below. Thank him for all the work he did on this. And for really helping out the community on this one. So thanks again guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Drop a like. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll talk to you guys again soon.